Hi, I'm Allison. In this short clip, I'm going to talk about test cases. I'll explain how test cases can save your company's reputation and show you how you can create test cases in just a few minutes. So why do we need test cases in the first place? Test cases have an important role in protecting your company's reputation. We're all familiar with software products that are released to the market with critical bugs that are later being discovered by the clients. This can be very embarrassing, but also can cost your company a great deal of money and even hurt people's lives. Let me give you two examples. The infamous iPhone 4 bug was estimated to cost Apple $175 million for free cases in addition to multiple class action lawsuits filed by thousands of disgruntled users. The 2003 Northeast power blackout was caused by a software alarm system failure. 50 million people lost power for two days. The event caused 11 deaths and cost $6 billion. These kinds of events can be prevented by using a test case system. A test case system is the backbone of the software testing process and enables you to define a list of tests to make sure every part of your software is properly tested before it's released to the client. You don't want to leave anything to chance. I'm sure your team is a group of highly trained professionals, but we're all human and humans sometimes forget things. You want to make sure that everything has been tested during software testing and nothing has been forgotten. As a manager, people won't remember how many bugs you have found. Even if you caught a thousand bugs during the testing process, what people will always remember is the one bug that slipped through the cracks and was found by your client. Elementool enables you to create a closed circuit system that locks the bugs inside and prevents them from slipping through the cracks. The process of writing test cases is as follows. You start by creating a test list tree and defining the different features for each requirement. Then you break down each feature into a list of tests. When you're doing this, you want to think about all the ways that people might use each feature and then look for places where it could potentially fail. You create a list of tests for correct behavior that the system should support to make sure that the product does what it's supposed to do. Then you create a list of tests of incorrect behavior that the system should not support to make sure the system can handle events that don't follow its business rules. I'll give you an example. Let's say that you build a credit card payment page. You want to create a list of tests that check if the page can accept valid credit card details of the different credit card companies. You also should create a list of tests that check if the page rejects invalid credit card details, such as credit cards that have expired, characters instead of credit card numbers, and so on. Each test needs to have a defined list of steps for the tester to follow in order to complete them. Remember, you don't want to leave anything to chance, and you want to make sure nothing is overlooked. The tester will mark the status of each test as passed or failed, and then submit the test results into the system. Doing this allows the testing manager to keep track of the progress of the testing. Make sure to give a priority to each test, running the highest priority test first before working your way down to the lowest priority. You want to focus on first finding those high priority bugs, the ones that do major damage like crashing the software. If the schedule allows, you can then move on to the lower priority issues. In the event that a bug is discovered during testing, the tester should submit a new issue to the issue tracking system that describes the bug. The new issue should be assigned to the project manager that needs to add it to the iteration plan and schedule, and then it will be assigned to the appropriate team members for fixing. Elementool enables you to link bugs to tests. This way it's easy to track the progress of the bugs that have been reported. It also prevents testers from submitting duplicate bugs if a similar bug has already been reported for this specific test. So that you can protect your company's reputation by always finding bugs before your clients do, I'd like to offer you the test cases and issue tracking software right now for only $119.99 a month. Added to this, I'm going to give you two extra services for free. Scheduling, for making sure your project is developed according to plan, and requirements management, for making sure the project is developed according to what your clients want. So click on the button below and upgrade your account now.